Hello YouTube, yes it's me. It is indeed Orberon, Zarlot, Star Dragon, O, capital O, as you know, capital O, small b, small e, small r, small o, small n, that's my name Orberon, I just spelt it wrong. Sorry, big O, small r, small b, small e, small r, small o, small n. That's my first name, Oberon. Zarlot, capital Z, small a, small r, small l, small o, small t. And then Star Dragon, capital S, small t, small a, small r, capital D, small r, small a, small g, small o, small n. And that's how you spell all of my name. This is a magical name. So the hat I so the hat that I was just wearing is a wizard's hat. Now, first of all, this other hat that I could have worn here, this is a witch's hat. Now can you guys all see the difference? Wizard's hat, witch's hat. So a wizard's hat goes up in a cone a cone shape or conical. And then as you can see, instead of going up straight into a point, like most cones, it curves. See, curves. See, notice the curve here and here and on the sides here. And then ends in a point. And that is a wizard's hat. Now, obviously it could have, as well as having all these stars in and around it, it could have moons and suns and crescent moons as well. Not full moons and crescent moons as well as the sun. Um, but anyway, they're the wrong type of stars, as you know, because I wear a nice... I wear a nice star, which I will have to bring much further to the, to the camera for you, just so you can see it. There you are. Sorry, it's not a great angle. Sorry that it... <clears throat> now, I am so sorry that that is not a great angle. Now, I did try to do... I did do a longer video previously earlier, but for some reason, YouTube decided to have a bit of a temper tantrum about loading it up, even though I attempted to do so with it three times. And it was about clo the clothing of paganism, and of course... Um, and of course... Um, um, the tools. Anyway, but that one is not what we're doing, we are doing this. And this is a witch's hat. Now, as you can see, like a traffic cone, it goes all the way up in a cone and straight into a point like a traffic cone with a wider circular brim. Now, as you can see, as I said, yes, the wizard's hat also has a nice wide circular brim or wide-ish, but it does not. I have another version of the wizard's hat here does not go up the same way as a witch's hat. So, I'll do this again. I will do this again for you to make it simple. Wizard's hat, witch's hat. Now please take note of the difference. Those of you who do not know the difference at all. Anyway, so that's first of all some clothing issues. And what am I wearing? Well, I am wearing a set of ropes. Now I'm gonna have to come a bit closer to the camera for this just so you can see me. Um, actually, I can, I can turn around. Now this, as you can see, is called a set, it's, a, it's rose because it has a long flowing material. Well, it's obviously longer than the camera angle that you can all see. And it has a hood at the back as you saw. And I'll show you where it looks like with the hood up. It may not look very good, but I won't be able to show, well, I will be able to check afterwards, but uh, anyway. And there. Now it doesn't hide 
all of my face, but it does hide some of it. And obviously that's what I look like with the hood up. So there we go. Yes, excuse the facial hair. I have let it grow a little bit, which is really a big thing for me, but well. Now I could do a bit more on the, the tools, but I will have to go back and look at the other tool videos that I've done in the past to um, try and find out what they are. Try to find out what they are. Also, oh, actually, no, I won't do that. Actually, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll just do a whole video on the tools. Now, the piece of music you're listening to at the moment is a lightning bolt and thunderstorm uh, recording. It's on a CD, and I put it on my CD player so that it can carry on. Oops. Yes, I think it has just stopped and my staff just fell on the floor. So I'm going to put on some other music now to continue with. So excuse me whilst so please excuse me whilst I do that. Oh no. Oh no, am I mistake? The C D is still going. Okay then, then I will gladly continue. So a little life update for you guys as well, uh, which is the channel has now got 36 subscribers. So that's for those of you who don't know how 36 might look or three and six. That's three tens and only six units in the old fashioned way of doing it. Pardon me. Units in singular numbers such as ones. Mm -hmm. So anyway, life update now as well. So first of all, before I get to the life update, thank you to all 36 subscribers so far. Uh, what I will do is do a special video for you guys, all of you. Um, at some point. I don't know when that will be, but I will do something. And also a little life update for you guys as well today. I recently, just before the third lockdown kind of, when the, fir the third lockdown kind of eased a little bit, before the full ease of, as of um, a mon about three or four Mondays ago, um, I started going to this uh, sort of multi-faith or multi-spiritual practice kind of church. Now, this is not your typical Christian or uh, Catholic kind of Christian Catholic kind of church, but it is a church nonetheless. But uh, all sorts of faith people go there: Christians, Jews, uh, the Muslims who are of course the followers of Islam, Baha'is, Sikhs, Hindus, and pagans are very welcome there as well. So uh, yes, I've been going to a lot of their meetings and they ha they do sing hymns like in a Christian church um, but their hymns are not specifically one religion or spiritual path focused doctrines so not specifically pagan or Christian or etc et focused hymns which is great for me obviously the ones I don't really like are singing obviously are the ones where there's a Christian thing like of only one singular God uh, but apart from that any others that are, are multi you know multi-faith focusing are great because they're not too long and well they are some are might maybe are a bit long but uh, but I do but I do like going there I, I feel very welcome and I feel very I don't feel pressured into you know I don't feel like I'm wrong to be pagan and I don't feel like I need to go back to being a Christian anymore and they're not trying to force that any of any specific one spiritual practice or religious ideal onto or philosophy onto me, which is great. So, so also some ideas for the channel would be great from you guys, of course, in the comments uh, section down below, which is where you can see, I can't see it, but it would be down below my camera and therefore the screen that you can see. So it'll be on your screen when you see it on YouTube. Uh, and that would be wonderful as well because I would like to get some feedback from you guys, some positive feedback, not negative feedback, because that's never good for anybody. Um, and I again, I remind you that although Google 
Google do not want me to tell you this. They own YouTube and therefore, so when they, if I have at least 1,000 or more subscribers, I will get paid through both of them to put content out there for you guys. So at the moment, I am not getting paid to do this. I do this off my own free time and my own free will. And also, I can also get, I, that's why I cannot pay the lovely lady who you sometimes see on here, Mama, capital M, small a, apostrophe in the air, capital M, small a, BH, capital B, small e, small e, A, T, C, H. All small letters for the rest of it. Mama Biatch, so I've just spelt her name for you. I cannot pay her either to come here and give up her free time and of course do videos as well when you see her for some entertaining videos of course um but yes if we can get that if i can get this channel that far then you know i'm going to get some money from youtube and google and google so there you go a little bit of extra information for you there also i would like to at some point Call you my you guys my subscribers i'd like to call you a fan base but a fan base or fan group or a group of fans they need well they need they need a name now i have lots of ideas for what the fan name could be but i want you guys also in the comments sections below or section below to give me some suggestions and what I will do, because the YouTube polls apparently are not very good for these things, and they only allow four choices in a, in a poll. So what I'm going to do is, I will do it by, um, on the comments, whoever likes the comment for the name for the fat for you guys, the fans, what I will do is I will see which one of the names, the suggestions that you guys suggest to name yourselves as the fans of this channel and of course therefore which you are my subscribers and whichever one gets the most whichever one gets the most likes in the comments sections down here then what i'm going to do is whichever one of those gets the most likes and i will choose that name for the fans for the subscribers and you are there for my fan base so, once we, that's chosen, hopefully we won't have to change it. Um, now, obviously, I do not want to change it once it's, once it's been chosen, but uh, ho so hopefully, once it has been chosen, I do not have to change it, and uh, all the fans slash, subscribe, slash subscribers will like it. So, the next video, I don't really know what I'm going to do, but I do have an idea or two about um, maybe some ideas that we can do from the, well, that spiritual multi-faith church I, told, well, I was telling you about at the beginning is called a Unitarian church. And they have a very big movement here, a very big movement here in the UK and abroad across the pond, as it were, in America. I don't know about Australia and New Zealand and other spe English speaking countries or uh, settlements and whatever. But I do, I know about, I only know at the moment about America and the United Kingdom. Now, but there you are, it's not, I know it's not much of a video today, but what I want to do is a little something different, which I haven't, don't know if I've got what I need. I may not have what I need to do this, so I'll just go and see if I can find it in a minute. Normally, before I end the video, I usually send you, you know, I usually give you all the... Now, usually before I end the video, I think I give you all a, a blessing of some sort or other description, um, I, which I may do. I don't want to ramble on too much, and I think I've rambled on enough for now, because I've got about, I've gone into about 15 minutes in this video so far. So, um, but I'm going to leave the... Um, 
CV going for you, practically instead it stops. So I'm going to say goodbye to you all now with blessings of brightness, which we have today, a little bit of, happiness, love, and positivity from me to all of you. Goodbye.